Then what happens? Judges retire. Just on the eve of their retirement, the judgments given by them are becoming questionable. Questionable. You know the Ayodhya judgment was given. It was challenged, it was questioned by many people. But judges go scot free. And in fact, some judges take the patronage of the government of the day. That is why certain things are being questioned in public. Whether judges can take up some jobs, whether judges can become governors immediately after their retirement or whether they can be made parliament members immediately after their retirement. So there is a suggestion, judges should have cooling period. After their retirement, some five years, or that can be discussed and decided. At least minimum five years, they should not accept any other position given by any government. Because these are all methods of concern. So when we discuss role of judiciary, judiciary must be the hope for the people. And judiciary is the protector of our constitution. It should act as a protector of our constitution. If I violate constitution, judiciary should question me. If the government violates constitution, Judiciary should question. Mr. Modi violates constitution. Judiciary should question. Mr. Raja violates constitution. Judiciary will get it. Can, uh, question me. What is the problem? Finally, we are all citizens. And our guiding document is constitution. How can we violate the constitution? 